Alright, and we're getting this started. We're gonna get Goldeneye Nightshade over here on Hyrule on FD here. This is Goldeneye's favorite stage here, and Nightshade looks like he's been going a lot of Ganon. I think I recall him playing some Link, but it looks like he's being serious about this uh, good, or, good old Lord of Evil. This is rough. This is rough. Ganon, when he gets in, he's gonna hit like a truck, but he really has to get in. And like this, percents are pretty even, but as they climb, there's going to be Ganon being offstage more. Oh man, that's going to hurt. And there it is. Forward tilt's just keeping him out here. He's got to make it off ledge. I am very surprised that dash attack even hit his ledge hang. Ganon has the lowest ledge hang in the game. It's almost impossible to hit him there. Right now, though. Ooh! I like that. Bringing it back to even. Good stuff here. Oh, got a tech chase situation. So, fun fact about Simon's down tilt. There is actually a lot of lag after that second hit. If you shield that second hit, you can let go shield and chase after him and get an attack off. So, it's a little bit of things for you guys to work on. The question is whether or not he'll do the second hit. And that's, that's what you got to react to. Gosh, Nightshade actually getting the lead here. A lot of damage on Goldeneye. Oh, but Holy Water going to send him off. That's not where you want to be. Almost getting the kill there. Oh, but he catches him on the way up. And like that, Nightshade has the stock lead. Up, oh, up. Oh, nope. Holy Water not going to connect on the ground. Ends up bouncing off the side. And he gets under the forward smash. Nightshade has escaped death multiple times here. He's going to down B into the cross. I mean, look. That works, but never is it usually is it a good idea to hit the cross. It, it, it just sets you up for disaster. Goldeneye right now really got to get this kill. And there it is, 54% on Goldeneye. And I think Goldeneye is now being a much more careful, but we shall see. Right now, 81 on Goldeneye. This is not a place to be right now against a Ganon of all things. Who just back aired an axe? Excuse me, sir. Oh, he tries to go for the forward smash, tries to go for a forward smash. Oh my gosh. Like this, though, Goldeneye has not gotten hit his whole entire stock. And, I mean, I might commentate curse him right now, but he's done 83%. Oh, my gosh. 103 right now. Uncontested. And Nightshade gets a little bit antsy, gets a little too low there. Goldeneye is going to bring that one back. All right, Nightshade having a good lead there, but got a little bit antsy. Looked like Goldeneye really took a deep breath and started just saying, I need to keep this Ganon away from me at all costs. And look, nerves get to you guys. It does. It, it takes a lot of practice to have the nerves not hit. And what irritates me is they used to not affect me, and then they started affecting me again, because I just don't compete anymore. I just play for fun.
All right then. Ready? And we're getting into game two. Looking like Nightshade sticking with this Lord of Evil. Let's see what happens. Wonder what the stage is going to be. All right, so we're going to Smashville. Not a lot of space here. Ganon under that platform can prove to be rather annoying for Simon. But the problem is the stage is so small that all Goldeneye has to do is just walk away and then just have tilt. That's all he has to do. Oh, going to get the tech chase. Good damage. Oh my gosh, and like this, Goldeneye may just die, but gonna make it back. It's it's scary. It's scary when Ganon's able to do that stuff to you. But he's angling the F-Smash down, and those angled downs have missed. But that axe is gonna come through the stage there. Just setting up the trap, and there is the tipper. Still though, 79%. Good stuff the Nightshade there, but you gotta be careful with these, with these smash attacks. As I say that, he kills him. God dang it. <laughs> you get punished for those if they miss. <laughs> Nightshade making me eat my own advice here. Oh my gosh. God, you're just seeing how hard Ganon's trying to get in right here. But, gets the hit. He's just gonna go and hit that. Jeez. Oh my god, those forward airs are so strong. This is not free for Goldeneye by any means. And you know what? That's unfortunate. Goldeneye just saved his opponent. <laughs> Axe into F tilt. Axe into F tilt. That's unfortunate though, because he he misinputted the cross, and not only did the cross was it not an up B, it actually saved him. F tilt there. You don't need to try to go for a grab. He's at 160. He'll die from a lot of stuff. Right now, there's 50 on Goldeneye. 78. This ain't looking good. Oh my gosh, Nightshade. You're insane, buddy. There it is. F tilt kill from center stage. <laughs> In the dash stack. Good little damage here. Oh my gosh. And this is the thing, it's so scary because if Ganon touches him, he's off stage. Oh, okay. Oh my god, that back air was pixels away. That up smash hit him. <laughs> what are you doing in the face? We got game three here, ladies and gentlemen. Good stuff to Nightshade. Nightshade was a little bit like, ah, I don't want to fight Goldeneye, but hey, you're showing stuff. The counter pick on the stage works. All right, looking at our losers matches, it looks like everyone here is now checked in, except for a uh, Kyubi. Other than that, everyone here is going, and Minty's going to take it a two over Roxas. Oh man, been a while since we've seen Roxas, and he's actually already out. Prade and Loren are duking it out. That's going to be good. Celestial versus Monkey BQ up on Winter Side. He says on Alpha or one one. Which, Alpha has experience against my Toon Link, but T-Sizzles is definitely not the same. Looks like he's also been going Inkling, though. Interesting. And Captain Jiggly's getting to run back on Ricky. That was a very good set last week. Ready? And we're getting into Game 3 here. On to PS2, very, very, very big stage. Definitely gives Goldeneye a lot more space to work with. Gotta be careful though, because uh, Ganon does have that burst option of that down B, and like that, 50%. Oh, he just waits there. 
And the axes are coming down. The fire is on deck. And sadly, rolling in on, on Simon just doesn't work. Really doesn't. Oh my gosh. All right, throws him off stage. Going on, Excalibur. Good to see you, man. And like that, Golden Knight going to take that first stock here. Up, oh, he's okay. All right. Oh my gosh. That axe at point blank, though, definitely not good. Nightshade gonna capitalize on those down airs. Looks like Gold Knight's getting a little bit antsy with those. And not gonna get it there, though. 83 on Nightshade here. Oh, it's gonna catch him. Gonna just forward tilt him there. If you tech that, you'll be okay. We have to tech immediately. Down tilt, though, will work. And like this, percents are already climbing here. God. Nightshade is actually really scaring Goldeneye right now. Oh, forward air. Yeah, Nightshade's throwing out a ton of hitboxes. And his low ledge hang really makes it hard for him for uh, Simon to hit the holy water there. Axe coming in, not gonna tip him. Trying to shark him there with those up airs, but he got him off stage here. Oh my gosh. Both of them rolling very, very close there. Oh, let's get some back air down there. Nightshade would have killed him. And Force Mash gonna come in there. Goldeneye bringing the percent lead here, but I mean, this is still, this isn't exactly. <laughs> okay. Okay, now that he's done that, now he really can't afford to make mistakes. <laughs> Holy Water coming in, and that down B got buffered. Goldeneye gonna take it there, a 2-1. Good stuff to Nightshade there. He definitely made him sweat a bit there. We'll back this up for you. You can take a look at your match. Good stuff overall, though. I definitely want to play your Ganon.